Wait, it's all the rings. Um. So I, uh, I meant to try this on Sunday. It is now Wednesday. Uh, but yeah, Sunday because of Game of Thrones. Uh, I bought this blonde ale called the Iron Throne from Brewery Olmgon. Old game from Cooperstown, New York. Uh, it's a big one. It's a huge, huge bottle. But yeah, Game of Thrones. I like it, and I like blondes. Not, you get it. Um, but yeah, I wanted to try it out because just like little kids who see their favorite cartoon character. On a package of macaroni and immediately want the macaroni. It doesn't really change. So, I'll stick one of my favorite shows on a bottle of beer. And I'm gonna buy a bottle of beer. It comes with a cork, which is exciting. Let's hope I don't break the light. Or the camera. Alright, that was cool. It smells alright. It doesn't smell terrible. Oh. I may regret that. We'll see. It is very blonde. Mm -hmm. Yes, indeed. I even got a special glass just for this video. Because I'm just that kind of person. I bust out all the stops for you guys. So there it is, yellow, it smells like beer, which is good. Uh, it's not terrible, I was a little concerned because I've had some beers that taste like Budweiser. Um, and in case you're not aware, Budweiser is terrible beer. But. It smells like Budweiser. Kind of almost tastes like it too. Um, I mean, I can see some appeal in it. But I wouldn't regularly spend, what it was this, like $10 on a bottle this big for beer that tastes like this. So, as an experiment, great. Not bad. But, as a beer itself, nah. I could, like if there was nothing else, I would drink it. So yeah, there you go. Game of Thrones Blonde Ale from Omagang. Omagang. Oh my god. Brewery in Cooperstown, New York. Uh, I'm doing well. I don't make videos too often, and I'm sorry for that. But... Here I am now, drinking a new beer, just for you. Oh, and I got a watermelon beer, and I'll try that soon. So yeah, see ya. Why doesn't my remote work?